What is up guys, in this video I'm going to be ranking all of the flags in Pet Simulator 99. Um, shout out to one of my fans on Discord and they gave me the video idea. But anyways guys, let's just get right into it. So I'm not going to be using a tier list for this because I'm just I'm just too lazy to, to use one. So I'm just going to be ranking them, you know, pretty much um, against each other and giving them like some sort of letter grade. So well, we're just going to be doing that and um, yeah. So the worst flag i think that's in the game is the rainbow flag which turns all your pets to rainbow but this one's useless because you know i feel like most people already have uh full teams of rainbow pets um if you don't you should really be doing that and um the, turning the uh, huges or titanics to rainbow isn't really going to make them any better it's it's literally it's going to be like sort of like a fake rainbow version of a huge part of titanic but yeah so I'm, this one's the worst flag i think this one should definitely it shouldn't be divine flag it should be like an epic or something but yeah so i'm going to be ranking this one a d i don't think this one is uh i don't think this one's really good um we're going moving on to number eight we have the coins flag and the coins flag is actually you know it turns your pet so uh, it gives your pets well like pretty much you uh 50 more coins in an area the reason why i think this one's also not that great is because i feel like if you have a good team you're not going to need more coins because the pets are already going to be uh give it, giving you more coins um, or you can use you know enchantments which work a lot better than the uh flags therefore i'm going to be rating this one a c so you know, I think it's an average flag. Moving on to number seven, we have the strength flag, which does the same thing, but for strength. And I think strength is more important than getting collecting coins. So I'm going to be ranking the strength flag a C plus because I think it's a little bit better than the coins flag. And I think it's, you know, it's pretty decent. Moving on to number six, we have the diamonds flag. And the reason why it's not higher on this list is because in a lot of areas, like the VIP area, it's nerfed and it won't actually work like in the VIP area. Because I, and I also tested this out myself, so yeah, I'm, I'm going to be rating this one a another C plus because I don't think it's you know, too crazy in terms of you know how, how good it is. So yeah, moving on to number five, we have the shiny flag, and this one it's decent. It's a lot better than the rainbow flag because less people have full teams of shiny pets. That's why I'm going to be rating this one a little bit higher they're not that much better than the uh, counterparts so but if you have a rainbow pets then that's going to definitely be a lot better because if you have rainbow pets then you're gonna have rainbow shinies and that's going to be amazing that's going to make your team a lot more p so i'm going to be wearing this one a b the number four we have the hasty flag and i think this one's pretty good if you don't want to have a speed enchantment in your uh, loadout because i feel like not many people use them then you can just use a hasty flag and that's also going to help out with the speed and it's a pretty good alternative so i'm going to bring this one a b plus i think it's pretty good flag now moving on to the three top three flags that i think are really great for the third spot we have the fortune flag which is a combination of the coins flag and the diamonds flag but it actually makes a diamonds um it's instead of it being two times more diamonds it's two point five times more diamonds so that's really great um i think this one's going to, that's a very op you know flag so i'm going to be rating this one an a plus because i think this flag is actually you know it's 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 a very great for uh grinding moving on to the second place spot we have the exotic treasure flag and it really does increase your job by quite a bit it's a very good alternative to the uh, super drops game pass I, I forgot what it's called but it, it's like a good drops game pass so it's a, a pretty good alternative and if you guys are trying to grind drops then it's a very uh, good flag to use i'm going to bring this one a solid s and then finally guys the best flag in the game i think is going to be the magna flag because if you because this one pretty much you don't have to do anything you don't have to like walk around you don't even have to use a magnet enchantments you literally just stay there and if you have auto farm then that's even better because that means you don't even have to be in the area to actually get stuff so as you can see um, it's only a rare which i think should be a lot greater it should not be just a rare but as you can see it's a very op flag and i think you know it's very underrated so i'm going to bring this one an s plus i think yeah, it's amazing that's pretty much it guys this wraps up the flags tier list and if you guys want to see more tier lists such as i don't know like items keys something like that uh, or like potions 
Let me know down below in the comments. But yeah, it's pretty much it, guys. Make sure you like and subscribe. Peace.